My goal with skateboarding was never to become like a pro skater. I always thought it would be cool to be pro, but it wasn't something that I felt like I needed to do or I needed to become. Um, there was one thing though that I did feel like was really, really cool and something that I would love to live out. And that would be to have my own like Rob Deerdick Fantasy Factory or like the Braille Skate Warehouse or the Barracks Warehouse. Like having your own private skate park, I thought was always just like the coolest thing ever. And if I could do that for myself, that would be super, super cool. I just feel like that would be a dream to live out for just me and my childhood. <laughs> so I told myself that I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try and build my very own Rob Deerdick Fantasy Factory, but Young Wavy style, and uh, just turn it into something special, turn it into something that's super cool, especially in my hometown where it's really hot in the summers, I feel like it'd be super incredible to have an indoor skate park. Of course, it'd be hard, but I really think I can do it. So here's the first step towards this massive goal. I'm renting out this huge storage unit, and basically the idea is, is to turn this into a fully functioning online skate shop. This will be a place where you can buy my clothes, my boards, my shoes, things from my actual bedroom, and things that you've probably seen in some of my videos and stuff. Hopefully this will be a place where you can get things for a decent price, at least just get things cheaper than you would at your local skate shop, or if you were to buy things brand new, hopefully you can get them for, you know. I have a ton of extra stuff, like extra shoes that I don't wear, maybe some things that are reviewed and I didn't like, and just, just a ton of things that I can get rid of and just give you guys a piece of me and just anything that I've built. If you guys have ever felt inspired by me or if I've taught you something and you just want something of mine, like maybe it's like one of my old boards or maybe it's like one of my old shoes and stuff like that, I don't know, like I can give you guys the opportunity by just putting it up here on this website and just letting you guys get a piece of it. <laughs> What the fudge? Yeah, sir. Oh, I love this. All right, there is one major problem though, and that is I'm doing this all alone. I'm trying to run a YouTube channel. I'm trying to consistently post on all my social medias like Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube, as well as try to run a brand new skate shop. And honestly, it's kind of a lot of work for one person. You would think that, oh, it's easy. A YouTuber's life, it's easy. But sometimes it can be really hard to find ways to monetize without being too like salesy, like buy my course or just like, you know how the typical YouTubers are. So I wanted to do something cooler. I wanted to do something that made it feel like you could actually become part of something and actually become part of a community that I created. And I just wanted it to feel special, so. Usually people hire teams of people to help them with something as big as this. Right now I'm solo, but it's kind of like One Piece where I'm playing King of the Pirates and I'm trying to build out my own pirate crew, my own Sanji and Zoro, my own Chopper and Robin and Nami and all these people who are going to play huge roles and that are going to be great friends of mine. And I don't know, it's just a cool way to look at it rather than business and all this boring business stuff. Nobody wants to hear about that, but when you really like when you relate it to something as cool as like anime and just having fun with it, I think that's where the magic is and that's where it becomes something really cool and special. So, I don't know. I'm just gonna have fun with it. Run with it. King of the Pirates. I'm gonna try to do something awesome. 
I got this super cool thing called a C-stand. Basically, it's like a tripod that you can like mount. Like it has arms like this to where you can put it low or high. That's how I'm getting all these pretty cool, crazy angles. Um, and something that I wanted to have a little more fun with. This is gonna be like my photography studio backdrop. You know, I got this fake plant here just to make things look a little live, but I got this plain white wall. It's supposed to be kind of like a cyclone wall, they call it, like a plain white backdrop, just completely white wall. But this is kind of like my version of it. I got like, I velcroed fabric to the walls and just put it all around this area and just turned it into like a cool little area where I could shoot content and stuff. I think it looks pretty sick though. Um, kind of having fun with it. I can shoot some lights back here as well to like change the colors, have some really, a lot of fun with photography and lights and cameras and stuff. I don't know. Something else I like to do besides just skateboarding. Here's what things kind of look like on the outside. It's kind of like some movie set kind of stuff. Like you got lights on tripods, like nice studio lights, two of them to make this place really shine bright because there's no windows in here or anything. And then this is the C-stand thing that I was talking about. Kind of like this C-shaped, well, it's not really C-shaped right now, but it's like a huge tripod that you can mount high or low and it's just super awesome. And then I put a rug here to make it just feel nice and warm as well as a stool with a fake plant. And this is just gonna be like a cool little photo shoot area and I'm gonna shoot clothes. I have a bunch of clothes right here show you guys the best part because I've been working hard on this studio yes there peep this ha <laughs> ha and these are supposed to turn on to here let me see if I can uh, turn those on too pow yes sir yes now we got the little clothing rack kind of thing going on I kind of wanted this area to feel a little bit like Tokyo since I went there recently and I just brought a lot of inspiration back. So we got the cherry blossoms with the lights, we got the red lanterns, and then this is just like a bunch of clothes that I have ready to just go on the shop, ready to shoot over here and just put on my website and stuff. So this is what we got going on, man. This is super sick. So. I'm going to do it. I'm going to build a super sick skate shop. Hopefully the sickest skate shop that you have ever heard of. And this will hopefully lead me into building my own branch, creating my own merch. I know I've done, I've teased like making pants and I've done like a little tech list drop, but nothing like super, nothing super, super big. And I think this is going to be my transition into creating something that's really awesome and special for you guys. I also think that this is going to be a way for me to actually live and be able to support myself as a creator because as a YouTuber, it's really hard to earn money from brand deals and sponsorships consistently. And usually the easier way to make money is to build community and sell something special directly to them. And to just have that kind of like tight relationship of like me giving you guys something and you guys giving me something in return. I don't know, man. I'm just don't wanna be one of those like lame salesy YouTubers, but I don't know, I really think this could be something cool. This could really be the start of something special. And I'm just really excited. Being in here just really excites me as well. So this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be dope. I hope that this inspires you guys to go out and try and build whatever dream that you have and just to make your dreams a reality because this has always been mine and just to even get my foot in the door to try to do something like this then I'm, I'm super fortunate because I know most people they're stuck with responsibilities stuck paying off cars or houses and you know if I have the opportunity to go out and reach something that most people wouldn't even try for then I'm gonna go out and do it. I'm gonna try because I have the ability to. So why not? Why not try and do it? Anyways, hope this video inspires you guys. I hope that you go out and follow your dreams and just do whatever it is that makes you happy because that's what it matters at the end of the day. Just finding your reason and being happy. And that's all I want for you guys. That's all I want for me, myself here in this channel. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to drop me a like. I will see you guys in the next one. Hopefully more some vlog style stuff like this. So. Till next time, peace out.